Tower Grove Neighborhood CDC promotes and improves quality of life by attracting public and private investment and providing real estate and other community services. We rehabilitate neighborhoods, not just buildings. We want our neighborhoods to be safe, affordable, and attractive to people and families in an environment that encourages and supports community. We do three things. We encourage and train all landlords to maintain and properly manage their properties, including screening tenants. We buy and rehab buildings to ensure professional and responsible development that attracts more homeowners to the neighborhood. We buy and rehab properties to recreate and maintain comfortable, quality, professionally managed, affordable apartments for low to moderate income people. Let's look at the wedge, the blocks of Hydraulic and Bamberger between Gravoy and Chippewa, one mile due south of Tower Grove Park. Bamberger in particular was a street where we had a number of vacant properties and a number of nuisance properties. Nobody would rent these places because of all the drug and the thieves. It all started with 3600 Bamberger. This was the biggest and most frequented drug house in the neighborhood. The Tower Grove neighborhood CDC bought this building, rehabilitated it twice, it got vandalized the first time and went on to buy two more buildings next door. And now that CDC cleaned it up, there's a police station right next door and they all know that there's cops here and people with kids started moving into the neighborhood. The ice cream truck comes and they get ice cream from the trunk, all the kids, and they, they play out on the front lawn, which they couldn't do before. We added trash cans, new landscaping, better lighting, neighborhood alley cleanups, ongoing trash pickup in collaboration with Covenant House, a police substation, a mural, and new signage, and we're still going. So I kind of feel somewhat connected to the community because this community is allowing me to teach young people job readiness skills and provide a service at the same time, so it's a win-win. The neighborhood is going through a transformation. We had issues with bad tenants, nuisance properties, uh, drugs, Thanks to the Tower Grove Development Corporation and the, the uh, help with Alderwoman Green and her leadership and good neighbors, things has gotten a lot better and, and I'm, I'm really excited about you know, uh, the direction the neighborhood is going in. The majority of the rental units that are on this block are still at 30 to 50 percent of, of AMI and have uh, really become an affordable option for folks in the neighborhood. They are really making a difference. Anytime that there's a problem with anything, CDC is right on top of it. They're actually tangible. You can touch them. You can get in touch with them. You know what I mean? So it doesn't have to go through 10 different people to speak to the person that you need to speak to. You can call them right up. They turn around time. is extremely fast. I started out working in nuisance and problem properties uh, for our service area, Tower Grove South, Shaw, and Southwest Garden. So we have areas that are a high majority of rentals. We see more nuisance properties. So we decided uh, to go boots on the ground and actually start buying the buildings uh, that were nuisance, problem properties, or abandoned uh, buildings in the area and rehabbing them. A number of them we turn into multifamily affordable housing units to be able to keep the rents low where people can afford to stay in good neighborhoods. Um, but then also some of them we turn into owner-occupied for sale houses because we realized that if we could buy these old houses, fix them up, especially the abandoned ones, the ones that have been vacant for a number of years, we would then have more vested families on the blocks. And that in itself helps stabilize the area. There was a previous landlord when I first moved in and he sold it to the organization Tower Grove and they took over and basically did a complete 180 to the neighborhood. It's quieter, it's more clean, it's friendlier. The green doors are hilarious. I think what they're doing is amazing because I've seen other rehabbing going on and it makes the locations unaffordable. They're putting good people in affordable housing and making this area better and just a lot more fun to live. We are one of many banks that support the Tower Grove Neighborhoods CDC and we have provided financing for them for rental units on this very street. Our mission is to make sure people have uh, affordable housing in a great neighborhood and what we get out of it in the long run is stability in the St. Louis region and people that are enjoying the pride of home ownership and or living on a, on a great street in South St. Louis. You know it's one thing to lend dollars 
to a developer, acquiring properties, um, performing rehabs, that sort of thing, on a one-off basis. When, when you start to develop the scale that the organization has undertaken, that's when you really start to see the transformative uh, results for the neighborhood. So touring the neighborhood with Sean, driving through the streets, and it's, you know, we, we did that property, we did that property, we did that property, we own this property, we rehabbed that one, we sold it. I mean, it, it's really impressive in the sense that you see the density with which uh, the organization has devoted its resources in this particular neighborhood. And because of that, that's, that's when you really start to see neighborhoods uh, transform into really what they can be. Sean Spencer and his team are great. Um, they are very upfront about what they need and how we can help them. It's great to see the development going on in the city to keep residents in the city instead of moving out because there's a lot of things to do in the city and the city that the city offers and why not housing. It's been a great partnership and one that we really look forward to uh, continuing in the future. I'm just happy to be here uh, to be a part of it and it's great to be able to drive down the streets and say hey I know that family that lives there, I know that family that lives there because you know being a part of the development is again it's just a very gratifying thing. The importance of community and economic development is vital to the success of the communities and it involves both public and private partnerships and Tower Grove is very important to us because they have done a phenomenal job of really just bringing back this community, bringing it back to life and um, ensuring that it remains uh, naturally affordable for folks with low to moderate income. All of our friends, the diversity on the block um, seems to just be growing in like the most uh, positive possible way. I'm just very excited and thankful that the, the organization has decided to come into the wedge and I'm, I'm, I'm even more excited about what's going to happen in the future. Our children have made lots of friends here, uh, boys, girls, every race, every ethnic background. I plan on living here until I die. Home ownership is still the American dream and it's nothing more gratifying than helping individuals and families to assist them in getting that dream. If you want to help us make St. Louis the best city it can be, join us.